Mm-hmm. Every one of them left that day, but after a week, they left with their pay. Because <laughs> I helped them. Mm-hmm. I said, now your mom and daddy done paid $45 for y'all to come to class this week. <laughs> That's what they had to pay. And most t- most years they call me to show the little kids how to pay. I said, now listen, first of all, I tell you like this, but I'm telling you how to pay. Use your imagination. Set your palette up. Put all your colors you want to put in something. Imagine what you want to do. And some of them say, well, this little guy dumped a bunch of black paint on his canvas without saying anything. And I said, what'd you do that for? But then me and him get talking. He said, I don't know. I just think I want everything in black. So I said, wipe some of that black off that off that canvas right there and get the match sticks right here and draw what you want to in that black. Now I said, pour a little bit of yellow on that, a little bit of red, a little bit of green. You know that boy had one of the prettiest abstract you ever did see. <laughs> they framed it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So I said, see that? No need to force this little, no argument. I straightened it right up for him. And he was happy. Now this little girl right here is an adult now. She went to college. She got inspired by what I told her. And the, the designer now. She designed different walls and things in New York. What's her name? Um, what's your name? Her daddy name is, I call him Rev. He's the mailman come along here. Mm-hmm. And, so you um, keep up with her through her daddy? Yeah. But, mm-hmm. but uh, yeah, he tell me what she does now. Mm-hmm. You know, but she was smart. But she would she would pay attention to what I show her and and, and was very serious about it. Mm-hmm. And, but she made something good out of that. Mm-hmm. And that's that's Miss Council check right there, where she was teaching her class on how to how to do Chinese writing, mm-hmm. and what the letters were. Mm-hmm. You see, what I just to show them how to do dogs, ducks, and chickens, and cows, and all the animals. Mm-hmm. But I used to tell the little kids my favorite animals were cat, dogs, and cats. <laughs> I had a cat named Tom. Then I had one named Bricket. That was my first dog. <laughs> but I, I always kept the dog. <laughs> now, I had one named Bullet, Coco, Lance. Um, what's the other one? The other little dog, he came here. He, he got stuck up under my barn outside. And I got him out. He was a little puppy. and But I saved him, but he was just too, too sick to live. And I had to take him away and get him put down. But that his name was Chester. Mm-hmm. I painted a paint by Chester. Mm-hmm. Chester Grocery Store. Mm-hmm. I said, Chester, you dead and going now, but you know what? I got a store for you. Mm-hmm. I just imagined him being on one of a store. Mm-hmm. So sometimes I would leave, you know, some people come back as animals, all kind of thing. We don't know that. Could be. You know? Mm-hmm.